With the recent Warzone integration, they added some perks, changed some perks, and even gave us perks that we get every single time we drop in. So today, I'm going to be going over the best perks and perk packages that you want to be running, and then I've got you with a live commentary. As I'm playing, talking through my thought process and why I'm doing what I'm doing as a 4KD player. Now, starting off, let's go over the five perks that you get every single game you drop in. You don't even need to get loadout to get these. When you jump from the plane, you will have these five perks. The first is going to be tack pads. This simply increases your slide speed and also allows you to full ADS while sliding. The second is going to be commando gloves. This one is pretty simple. It allows you to reload while sprinting. So it gives you a little bit more outplay potential when you're trying to get away from somebody and kind of stuck in that reload. The third thing is going to be quick grip gloves. I had to say that one slow, that one's tough. That is going to increase your weapon swap speed. Now, I want you to note that it does not increase your reload speed. It increases your ability or it makes the ability to swap weapons faster. Then we have climbing boots. You probably noticed this when climbing a ladder or mantling that it is much quicker. And then finally, probably the biggest change from Warzone 2 is the fact that overkill is a standard perk. So you no longer have to equip overkill. You just have that that when you drop in and set up your loadout. Now, when we look at custom perk packages, and I also do want to talk about perk packages that you can buy from the buy station. That perk is so, that perk, okay, so that perk might actually be busted, but we'll talk about that in game and which one is the best option. In this perk one slot and perk two slot, we have a long list of options. We are choosing two of these right here universally across the board with every single pro player, they are choosing Double time to increase our tax sprint duration and reduce refresh time, which is really good for being able to keep that tax sprint and play faster. And they are running sleight of hand. Those are universally across the board, the two most chosen options here. That just allows you to reload faster. Now, remember I told you the quick grip gloves do not allow you to reload faster. They allow you to weapon swap faster, but this gives you that increased reload time or that faster reload time so that you can reload your AR, reload your SMG and get back in the action. Now our perk three slot here, things start to get a little bit interesting. We've got a, a lot of good options. We've got quick fix, we've got tracker, we have have tempered we have resupply we have stalker here which increases your strafe and aim down sight movement speed so when we look at perk slot three and perk slot four we have to think about two things what does it give us and what are we giving up so quick fix right great option here when you are low health when you are base health if you only get broken and no base health gets taken away this perk doesn't really do anything but if you are like one shot and you get the thirst that immediately kind of starts regening your base health if you are one shot and you throw in a plate that immediately starts regening your base health of course we have tracker right here with all of the buildings on Vondel, Ashika, and Urzik's hand, this is definitely an option that needs to be thrown into consideration. We, of course, have Tempered. Throw two plates in as opposed to three. Allows you to get back into the fight quicker. I mean, think about this. How many times have you gotten it down, you are broken, and you go to replate, and by the time you're replated, they are revived, and now it's a little bit tougher of a fight. Tempered means we only throw in two plates. We can get back into that fight quicker. We, of course, have Resupply here, which resupplies our lethals and tacticals over 50 seconds, and then and like I said, Stalker increased strafe and aim down sight speed. Now, let me go ahead and remove a few. I'm going to remove Stalker. MW3, SMGs, and secondaries have great mobility already, so I don't think we need to be running Stalker. I don't think we need to be running Resupply. A lot of great lethals and tacticals, a lot of munitions boxes out there with stims and smokes. I don't think it's super necessary to be running Resupply, which leaves us with Quick Fix, Tracker, and Tempered. On Urzik's stand, there are some people that are running Tracker here, but in my opinion, Tracker is only beneficial when you are chasing somebody and the problem is when you get caught chasing somebody you can get caught being re-challenged for me when i'm getting chased i'm plating i'm sprinting while plating to get away and then as soon as that as soon as i'm replated i'm going to turn around and shoot that guy why is he chasing me well if you have tracker you're more likely to chase the person i always tell you if you're subscribed don't chase think ahead think about where that person is moving to and try to meet them as opposed to chasing them which leaves us with quick fix and tempered. This is totally up to you. I personally run quick fix because I fight outnumbered so much and the fact that you can find the tempered vest on the ground, but that tempered vest is never guaranteed. So I think both of those are really, really good options. Now in this perk four slot, this is another one that gets super interesting. We've got ghost. We have flex here. We have combat scout, bird's eye, high alert. We have resolute. So let's go back to the same thing. Let's think about 
what we're giving up or like what we're adding and what we're giving up. I don't like the ghost perk on Vondo and Ashika because at the end of the day, even if your teammate gets killed, you're going to ping on that mini map. There's absolutely an argument on Urzikstan to go ghost and stay off radar as much as possible. The other thing to keep in mind, we of course do have ghost vests on the ground. So going back to what I said with tempered, you absolutely can find a ghost vest. This flex perk here, really interesting one. On paper here with what we see, you know, it reduces combat noise what does that mean well it reduces the combat noise which actually makes footsteps sound a little bit clearer the audio has been slightly fixed but it hasn't really been fixed yet so flex is a great option especially on vondo and ashika we of course have combat scout coming back from warzone one which is basically if you and your squad are playing if you shoot somebody it live pings them and then of course it gives you that little outline that you can see where the enemy is kind of moving to if you are some you know, I talk about live pinging enemies all the time. This sort of automatically does it for you. We have bird's eye back, right? So giving we're, we're given that advanced UAV where we see basically where the enemy teammates are moving to, or, you know, we pop a UAV, we get that advanced UAV for a short period of time. So bird's eye is absolutely a good option. We have high alert. Basically, it's going to Tell you when somebody's looking at you, especially on Vondo and Ashika with a lot of the rooftops and a lot of the third partying and Urzik stand with the long range engagements. High alert could be a great option here. And then we have Resolute. When taking damage from gunfire, grants a short bonus to movement speed. I'm going to eliminate Resolute from the start here, right? Let's go start eliminating some things. I'm going to eliminate Resolute from the start. I don't think this is super beneficial. On paper, it looks good, but in-game, I don't think it's that that helpful. Now, when we talk about Bird's Eye here, once again, we have the Bird's Eye vest on the ground. So I don't think Bird's Eye is a great option to be running. So let's leave Bird's Eye off, especially because if we're running Bird's Eye, we're giving up some very valuable perks. Combat Scout, Combat Scout in Warzone 1 was a lot of fun, but I'm just not seeing it in Warzone 2 yet, primarily because of the two or three other options that we have here. Option number one, High Alert. Like I said, great option for Urzik, Stan, Vondel, and Ashika. If you struggle with awareness and kind of keeping your head on a swivel, High Alert is a great option. This is actually what I prefer to go with right now on Vondel and Ashika and Urzik, Stan, because it does notify me when I'm getting looked at, especially when I'm playing my positioning, which is crucial in this game still. Then we have Flex here, which, like I said, it just allows you to hear footsteps a little bit better. Urzik, Stan, I'm not totally so sold on this yet because... While we are in, you know, some close range gunfights, Vondo and Ashika is primarily close range. So we want to be using or mid range as well, but we want to be using the ability to kind of hear footsteps just to know when somebody is around us. And this thing is going to be pretty broken in my opinion. You're going to hear this in game. I'm actually using this for my, uh, for the live commentary that I have. And then there's Ghost. I think Ghost is only valuable on Urzik stand. So right now my perk package looks like this. You know, my perk package at the moment looks like double time sleight of hand quick fix and high alert or double time sleight of hand quick fix and flex let's go ahead and jump into the live commentary okay so let's go ahead and jump into the live commentary here you know i am playing solo duos one of my favorite game modes which means getting a loadout is going to be pretty easy for me because of the dynamic loadout cost so i'll probably just get loadout a bunch but in the case no actually it literally doesn't make sense for me to buy a perk package here but i'll tell you which one i like i like the legionnaire perk package i'll show you exactly where it is in the buy station it basically gives you double time sleight of hand and then the flex perk which is the audio one that helps you with footsteps so i think overall guys i like i value double time the most because it really increases um the fluidity of your movement in my opinion it just keeps everything super fluid so let's go ahead and nope we need to stow our gas mask let's try that again throw this in iso nine millimeter did i not grab the gun back here what was the gun back here Okay, I don't know where that gun went. No idea. Um, now, solo duos, guys, our whole thing here is... Well, two things. We're looking for a 20-kill dub. So, 20 kills and then, of course, winning. Uh, which means we need four in the first, four kills in the first cir circle, four kills in the second circle. We need six kills in the third circle and then six kills in endgame. So, that's the pacing we're going to be following. It's the pacing we're going to be following when it comes to regaining. Grab stims right here. Let's rock. One, two. Uh... Heard something back behind me there. So the perk package is right here. So it's second row, third one across. And like I said, guys, it's double time slate of hand primed, which doesn't do much for us. And then flex, which is super helpful. Let's not buy that, though. Let's buy loadout. 
Off the wall. Boom, boom, boom. Let's rock. I'll definitely think about doing some more of those. What's your secondary, Joe Striker? No, the WSP Swarm. I'm running the Swarm and the Ram right now. Great for Vondel. Great for Vondel. Let's see what we got here. Anybody over here? Doors are open. So many doors open. Nah, that's another team. 100% another team. No. Watch this. We're going to meet him right here. Told you. Okay, let's go ahead and work back up here. We're going right back to the rooftop. Good three kill start early, and that's where we just hear him in the corners. I just heard those guys. This guy's up here. I hear him floating around here. Those are my footsteps, yeah? I don't know. Let's go by UE. Let's buy UE and see. Where's this guy going? This guy's running away. We got one right around the corner here. Where are you? One above me there? One above me and one to my left side. No. We are bobbing and weaving right now. I gotta remember that I do have my loadout and I do have stims. Oh my gosh, chat. That was... I would love to know what that looked like. I would love to know what that looked like. Or that. Holy smokes. Let's push around this side here. We should be able to go meet him. Where are you? Why can't I shoot this guy? He called a mortar on me, which is fine. Wait, I can go shoot him with a pistol. Quick reload. Pressure's on him. He's a bullet. I was going to say, I need to just like not wait. I, 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 not that. I no, this guy's flying in on me. I can't get out of here. I need to get out. Need to get out. Need to get out. Shut that behind me. Holy smokes. We're, we're zooming. Enemy soldier incoming. Remaining operators from that squad. No. He's on loadout. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to push into this building just to reposition a little. That guy's across. Where are you? This guy above me? I think he's above me. Okay, so one above to my right and one still back behind me. Is he around the corner here? Up and over. 
Bye, Nikki. Nice knowing you. We are kind of... Fl I, I feel great this game. Holy smokes. Let's keep rocking. We need Yui. Nope. That guy's up top there. Let's reload real quick before... That guy was looking right at me. Do you hear those footsteps? Do you hear how loud they are? They're in here, 100%. Where are you? Are you in stairwell? Dude, literally, the one thing I was about to say is I have to turn the corner and just hip fire this, and I'm just not ready for him. Like, I, I can't, I can't, that, that can't happen there. That lack of anticipation cannot happen. Um, by the way, I have enough for loadout here, so let's just go get loadout down. That can't happen, dude. I, I can't, I can't, they, I, that's a gunfight that I cannot lose. It's just not, it, it's just so stupid, man. It's just such a bad play. All I had to do was anticipate. Notice that's the anticipation with, a, anticipation without intent, as I always talk about. Like, I anticipated that guy, I centered well, but I didn't actually think he was going to be there. I thought he was, I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay, so I have no I have no information, but thanks to cash flow, uh, we were able to get another loadout down and leave our leave our loadout up, which was contested. I don't hear anything. Okay, where is everybody? I might go back to where I was. I mean I know people were over there, right? Like that's the only thing I have to act on really. Yeah, let's go across. I think I technically do have enough for a Yui here, but... Oh, do I go? I think I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Where are you? Dude. Relax, guys. You don't want this. Guy floating to my right side. This team's really irritating. I told you. This guy needs to... There's one... There's one that was on my level right here. That guy had high alert. Uh, where? Let's go this way. I hear him right across. Enemies dropping into the AO. Resurgence has closed. No more chance. We're gonna hit this. Yeah, that just breaks our fall a little bit. That's all I needed to do there. I need to not take fall damage. Straight across. Yeah, straight across here. Two or one.
That's two. They are very close together. These guys are freaking passionate. We're just going to keep moving here. Come on. These guys are so annoying, man. They're so annoying, man. They're so annoying, man. Holy smokes. I'm a little bit worried about where his teammate is. Just like I said. Is he going to take zip? That's an epic live ping. That is a clutch live ping right there. Just so I know if he's going... Where are you? Where is this guy? Copy. UAV is on station. Recon online. That's two in there. That's two. Literally just. Everybody's just sitting in corners, dude. Be advised, UAV is exiting Holy here. smokes. Everybody's just sitting in corners. Gas is closing in. I was going to say, you couldn't have gone far. Oh my gosh, chat. I'm gonna use his own smoke. Chat, we might have to stim play this. Have a gas mask. Do I have stims? Dude, get to me. Dude, what the frick? I'm going to eat gas and get up top. I got to play high ground here. Last chance, soldier. Kill. Kill. Oh boy, only 
Nothing I can do. This guy is just... It is what it is. I hope you found today's video helpful. As I always say, let's get better today, and I will see you tomorrow.